Hi guys, so it's here, my what's on my iPhone 6 Plus video. So as you can see, I have the white iPhone and it's gold on the back. So I guess you can say I have the gold one and it is 16 gigs. And as you can see, I let it fall and it cracked. You guys might not see it, but I see it, so it bothers me. But yeah, that's my iPhone. And then that's just the case that I bought. I did get it from Amazon and I will be linking it down below for you guys. But it is like a totu case, that's what it says on it. It's pink and purple, and it does have a rubber inside and a purple backing on it. So with the case on, this is what my phone looks like on a regular basis. That's my lock screen, and then I do have the fingerprint on lock. And I promise you guys, I do not have a pineapple obsession. I just thought this background was really cute, and I got it off of Pinterest in case you're wondering. So, in my little top corner, I have this little box that says extra, and that's just the stuff that the phone came with, things that I don't really use, or that I don't use at all to be more specific. You can see what it is. Every iPhone does come with this stuff in there. Then I have weather, maps, calendar, clock, and oh my god, you guys, look at all my alarms. <laughs> I have so many for school so that I can wake up in the morning. It's ridiculous. Then I have the calculator app. I have a little folder here called Stuff, which is just reminders. Find my iPhone and iPeriod, which is a period tracking app. It works, I guess. <laughs> then I have Settings, iTunes Store, App Store, and Music. And I don't really have any music on my phone, and I'll show you guys why. But I just have this music that you two illegally downloaded into everyone's iPhone. And as you can see, it's stored on my iCloud. I don't even have it downloaded on my phone. So thanks, you two. Then I have my notes, health, which is so freaking cool because it tracks my steps and how much I've walked and how many miles. And it says 70 steps right now. I swear to you, I'm more active than this. <laughs> um, FaceTime, photos, camera, and WhatsApp. And that's just a messaging app that I use to talk with people overseas, like my family. And then down here on my dock, I have phone, contact, safari, and messages. Moving on to my next screen, I have Twitter. And if you guys aren't following me on Twitter, go ahead. Some more pineapples. I swear I'm not obsessed, but... My at name is hi underscore it's Luisana. It's at the end of every video. So if you want to check out my Twitter, feel free to follow me. And then moving on, I have YouTube, of course. And then I have Instagram. And if you're not following me on Instagram, follow me there as well. It's hey underscore it's Lou. Feel free to look at my pictures. And then I have Tumblr. And Tumblr is kind of one of those apps that I have an obsession with and then I stop. So you can see I'm not even logged in. And then I have Facebook, Facebook Messenger, Snapchat, which is private for now. And then I have my little folder, which is like my picture editing. That's Snap Upload, which just allows me to upload pictures from my photo album to Snapchat. Then I have Pick Jointer, and that's just like a photo collage app. I don't really use it, but if I do, ugh, freaking ads. <laughs> if I do, then I have a collage. Then Red Stamp, which I think is pretty freaking cool. Square Ready. Um, there goes some more ads. I just got this one, you guys, so I kind of don't know how to use it. But there's a picture, and then basically that's just what gives my Instagram pictures the white background. So yeah, and then I can just upload it straight onto Instagram. Then I also have Clone Camera, which I don't know how to use. I have Insta Collage, which is another collage making app. I don't know if you guys can see it, but those are little squares. <laughs> and then I also have Timer Cam, Insta Fish Eye, which is really cool, but I do not know what to take pictures of with this because it's just kind of hard to, you know, use. But hey, that's my camera, and that's me on the side. Hi, guys. But yeah, <laughs> I'll figure out what to take pictures of. Then that's Perfect 365. A lot of people use this to like edit their face. So when you see porcelain skin, guys, it is not me. It's this app. I swear to you, I'm actually, you know, indecent looking without all the makeup and the editing. 
so I kind of don't know how to use this app either. It is kind of hard to manage around, but you can change different settings on it. Um, you can change like the tone, the skin tone. You can give yourself a tan. You can give yourself blush, which, yeah, that's a little too much. I don't know if you want to do that. <laughs> Then down here I have Pinterest, which I love. It is so inspirational. If you do not have one, I suggest you download the app right now because Pinterest is life. And in this little folder that I like to call shop, I have Retail Me Not, which is a very useful coupon code app. And you have a lot of different stores. You can search for them and you can find really good deals on here. Then I have my yogurt, my yogurt land place. Amazon, Etsy, Wish, which is like a very inexpensive store. They have like nice sweaters and watches and things like that that you can get at very, very low prices. <laughs> um, It's just random things. I haven't found anything that I want yet, but if you guys want to check it out, you can look through it. Here's a really cool sweater that I thought was really nice and cozy for the winter time, and it's only listed for $11, you guys. So I might be rocking this next winter. <laughs> then I have Hot Look. If you haven't heard of Hot Look, it's like the Nordstrom rack. It has a lot of high-end brands, but um, they retail for like lower prices, I guess you can call it. I'm not sure. And then I also have my banking apps. Then there's Starbucks. Of course, I'm already a gold member. Like, hello, duh. Starbucks is also life. And my balance is zero dollars because I'm broke. Sucks to be me. And I have my mail, Pandora, and Songza. And those are the reasons why I don't have music on my phone because I use these apps instead. Songza is really cool because it's like different titles like brand new music, driving, waking up happy. And it basically lets you pick like what you're doing or like activities. So like if you're cooking, driving, and drinking, well not drinking and driving. <laughs> those are just little titles. Please don't do that. Or depending on your mood, or if you're like cheesy, if you're happy, if you're sad, it'll play music to how you're feeling at that time. So I always like to play today's pop hits when I'm driving, and then I choose the happy ones because duh, you gotta get pumped up while you're driving, get happy, and not too happy and get into a car accident. Moving on to page number three, I have Bookmine, which is just my local library app, and then I have Solitaire. I don't really play any games, but Solitaire is cool. I have Vine, and just like Tumblr, I have not signed on to it, but it's just a phase type of thing. I watch it when I want to, and then when I don't, I'm logged off. I have Survey Mini, which is another freaking cool app, you guys. Like, it will literally use the GPS on your phone to track the locations where you've been. Yeah, sounds creepy, but it'll give you surveys, and then at the end, it will give you points that you can cash in or super cool gift cards to like the movie theaters or like Victoria's Secret, JCPenney, restaurants like Sonic and stuff like that. So I find that really cool. Then I also have IFML, which is pretty funny to me. It entertains me. Um, it's like really sad to read some of these things, but um, kind of funny too. <laughs> yeah, but it's basically a little post that people put up anonymously of like, shitty things that happen in their life and you get to read about it so yeah that is all that is on my iphone i thank you guys for watching my videos like always and if you have any more questions about my phone or any new updates that i have on it just feel free to let me know and thank you so much i'll see you guys next time bye